There he's hanging out. I don't know. I like it though. Ooh. Oh wow. Yeah, I don't know what to think. So I think I'll just hang on. <laughs> Stay a big fish. Morning River Rats. We're at probably my favorite river. Cause there's big catfish in it, like giant catfish in it, but sometimes the river is pretty mean and you gotta earn them, which makes it even more special. I appreciate that. I'm gonna try to earn one. So let's go. Okay, I actually did bring coffee. I also have a toothbrush over here, so I should probably brush my teeth. I guess it'd be a good thing to do while the water's warming up. It's like a beautifully flat spot right there. Question of the day, do I do the French press or do I try the new instant coffee? Kind of leaning towards the French press today. Okay. Hopefully that'll make coffee. My teeth are brushed, getting a few nibbles, but hasn't mounted anything yet. Though he's trying really hard. Just ready for the coffee to be done. Where's my coffee cup? Jordan got me a coffee cup. That's his YouTube channel right there, Good Life Outdoorsman. He brought me that and I was like, huh, it looks like a perfect camping coffee cup. So here we are, camping with the coffee cup. Coffee is coming around. It's probably just about there, to tell you the truth. Yeah, the froth, the froth is real on this. Pretty impressed. Let's get to the pressing. It is pressed. Rinse this out. So it probably hasn't been rinsed out since the last time it got used. Mm, we might have some particulates, but we're camping. So, you know. Sanitation is just a do your best kind of thing. I usually do the energy drinks out of convenience, but I'm trying to refine a coffee system. At least one that I don't mind. Why are you pouring so weird? It's not like the best coffee I've ever had, but it's not bad. It's definitely gonna get drank. All right, I'm gonna quit messing around over here and we're gonna go try to catch the cats. The weather's not great for cats, although it is overcast. We did have a front come through and temp drop about 20 degrees from yesterday to the day. And but I want to get better at catching cats when a front rolls through. What a great opportunity. So I'm going to go do that. I'm trying to leave camp. These darn nibblers keep nibbling. 
This one might be a turtle. Had one whack that one pretty good though. Mm, could be a gar. If you're a gar, you're one heck of a gar, I bet. I think I'm gonna go downriver. Never fish downriver. Am I gonna bump or anchor though? Decisions in life. I got some live baits too. So I might try for Mr. Flathead Ugly Face. Wonder if the gar got the bait. Nope. Silver carp is tough. I drove around and, and looked and looked and looked and I think I found something interesting enough to get started. We will see. Starting off with this little chunk. So like I said, we are after the front, so uh, we'll see what that brings. Well, that was pretty cool. Oh, snoozing. We're gonna have to get out of here. He ran clear out in the middle and ripped off plenty of line. Stay on, buddy. It's a serious one. Serious-ish, at least. Or angry. Or serious and angry. I don't know, he's running all over the place though. We need to get away from this wing dike. I do know that. Wrong direction. Okay. He's right here. Oh, lots of power. Yep. <laughs> lots of power, lots of weight. Uh, stay off the boat. Okay. I back the drag off just a smidge. Um, hopefully we're far enough away from the structure. Wow, good way to start the day. We're just duking it out. He's heavy. I don't know how heavy. Let's get a look at him. Wow. We need to have a little more control than that. What are you doing, fish? Coming over by the net? That'd be mighty kind of you. Oh. Mad fish. Very mad fish. Well, he had him close that time. Matt's actually ready. Oh yeah. <laughs> I like that a lot. I had no idea how big he is. But he's pretty big. drag that tail I guess bumping was the right call get in there Damn, we got him he is ours oh, look at 
that noggin in that net. All right, I'm gonna motor over behind this wing dike, leave him in the water. Don't worry, I'll dunk him in here in a sec. Sweet. It's a good start to the trip. All right, let's uh, get this heifer in here. I don't know how big, a pretty good one. Hooked real good too, which I appreciate. A long, worn out, drawn out battle. Let's get Chubby out of the net. This definitely qualifies as Chubby. Oh, ow. Quit being a butthead. Yep. I'm just gonna have to embrace the slime when they get this big. Yep. <laughs> Good start to the day, I'd say. Something just fell. I don't know what. Hopefully nothing too important. But yeah, that's a heck of a start to the day right there. I don't know what else to say. Am I rhyming again? Anyway, this is uh he hit it hard, smacked it, fought awesome, and I don't know, I don't know if the fall feed bag's coming on or what, but <sighs> he is hungry. I liked it. I'm gonna get him back. <sighs> Alright, buddy. Back in you go. <sighs> I like it when you're hard to hold up. Probably all slimy. These blue cats are impressively slimy. Both kind of wore out after that one. We're also both slimy. You fought like a champ. You ready? You're wiggling. There she goes. Delicate and peaceful and definitely tired too. <sighs> Morning. I don't know if I need coffee anymore. Still gonna drink it. <sighs> that warmed me up. Let's get another one. <laughs> well, that was exciting. Took care of my morning business. Also took my sweatshirt off. Not because it's slimy, but it's warming up a little bit even. Let's see what that does to the bite. I mean, we've only had a bite. I need to go find another spot like the one I just caught that fish at, though, to see if I can do it again. I found some stuff that looks similar. I also saw one really, really big fish that's in a catfishy kind of spot. So I'm hoping it's a catfish. in a log, pulled them out of a log. Might be eater size maybe? I don't know. He's getting heavier now. I don't know if he's tangled up or he's just better than I thought. Well, he's all right. Should be able to flip him in the boat. Two spots, two fish, I like it. spot lock here or try to I want to keep bumping this oh, 
Easy, easy. Well, the fish is in the boat. The spot lock's freaking out. Some decent current here. Okay. Well, he's kind of wonky looking. He's got, I can't tell very well in the video, but he's got a weird humpy back. Yeah, when he decided he wanted to go, he went. That's sweet. Not quite small enough to eat. Although I have plenty of food. I don't know if I'll keep it and eat or not. We'll see. It's hard not to have fried fish at least once when I plan on being out here a few days. Hopefully we'll get a smaller one. Au revoir. Quick. I am a fan. And if you're wondering why I'm using the reel that I'm using, this is actually Ryan's setup, and he's like, go see if it can handle bumping. So far, it's doing good. It's one of them PC Fun alloys. I think that's how you pronounce it, the 400 size. Sharp looking reel. It's light, probably because there's a lot of plastic, but handled that last fish pretty good. Nice to catch another one, another big dog. See how it does with two. No sponsorship, just trying stuff out. I try gear out all the time. Some kind of a gear snob, but I'll link it in the description if anybody wants to check them out. Pretty reasonably priced. There we go. I don't know. He just ran to the side. He's kind of spunky, but he's solid. Are you in something? Or are you just really big? Oh, you are in something. Yep. You are in a tree for sure. Are you running at me? For sure. There. You're not tiny. I don't think you're as big as that one. You're pretty nice. Okay. <laughs> it's not very easy to move. I can move him. This is a, turned into a pretty heck of a good day. Slime the line all up. Oh yeah, he's nice. Wonder if that's the one I saw. Oh yeah. Another porky pig. Alright, I need to figure my life out from a boat positioning standpoint. Probably get this fish in the boat. A little spot lock here and see how it shakes out. Come on. Okay, he's in the net too. Another dandy. He's got a forked whisker, which is kind of neat. I always find that interesting. Another porky one. I really don't want to get slimed if I can help it, but you know, sometimes you just can't help it. All right. I don't know if this is the one that I saw, but he's pretty nice and he's uh, in a similar spot to the one that I saw in the fish finder. I guess I really don't care. Just happy to have caught, caught this guy. It's two dandies on the day. All right, put him back too. 
Down, back to his home. I honestly thought it'd be pretty tough fishing. And it still might be, like not right now, but it might get to that point because just had that front roll through, but it was a pleasant surprise. I'm gonna ride this train as long as I can. We'll see where she ends up at. We beat up on the blues today. Might end up switching and trying to catch a flathead. Got a few flatheads here, but like to figure out a pattern for them too. That'd be pretty neat. I'm gonna keep doing this for a little while. Wow, oh. he's mad. Everywhere they're supposed to be, they've been. Ah, he's another heavy one. <laughs> okay then. He's fast. I don't know what we're dealing with for sure yet. I don't think, I don't know. I can move him. But he's running up river. Sometimes that's a sign of a real big one. Uh, it's pretty solid there. Okay, buddy. There he's hanging out. I don't know. I like it though. Ooh. Oh, wow. Yeah, I don't know what to think. So I think I'll just hang on. <laughs> Stay a big fish. Gotta appreciate them. They don't happen all the time. <laughs> yeah, I'm not too worked up yet because I don't know how big he is. But he ain't real easy to move. Okay. Trying to get this ready. Okay, we're good there. Wow, he's heavy. I really don't know. I didn't think he was all that big at first. Now I'm starting to wonder. He's pretty big. <laughs> he ain't giving up none. Should probably start getting out into the main. So we got a obstruction coming. Oh yeah. It's another slob. Wow. He's long, long, lean, and powerful. Should probably get this ready for when I get my shot. Hopefully, I get a shot. Okay. Oh, wow. Yep. Get. Yeah. I just rolled up in it. Holy crap, you are big. Come here. Yep, swim down, pop up, and then I'll scoop you. Yep, just like that. Yes. <laughs> oh, wow. Oh, this day is getting out of hand. Okay. Yeah, I don't know how big this one is, but I think it's the biggest one so far. I think he's stuck. Oh, 
Uh, yeah, he's the biggest one so far. He's up there with probably my biggest ever. All right, he's not my biggest ever, but he's big, real big. Just gonna embrace the slime on this guy. <laughs> what a, I mean, he's slob, but he's also long, lean, athletic, and fought like a champ. What a beast. I don't know, this is a pretty epic day by my standards. I don't like to throw the word epic around, but it feels pretty darn epic. Get you back in the water. <laughs> Chubby's ready. Okay, see ya. Oh, there she took off. She was fighting and floated away belly up, but I just saw her tail kick to the bottom. Good. I think I'm end this video right there. It's a pretty epic morning of fishing. Exciting thing is, got a lot more time to fine tune things and hopefully keep it dialed, but it's pretty awesome. I know there's a lot better fishermen out there than me that have had a lot better days than this, but first time I've ever caught that many fish of that caliber in a short period of time, and I feel kind of spoiled. But I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, hit the like button. If you want to see more, hit the subscribe button. If you want to support me, check out, you know, you can get some river merchandise or river certified merchandise. You can waterland sunglasses, uh, bush, big foot bushcraft fire starters. I'm stuttering. I'm so excited. But the promo codes and links for that are in the description. And if you don't want to do any of that, that's cool. Just appreciate the heck out of you taking time to watch. Sounds repetitive because I say it at the end of the video, every video, but I say it because I mean it. So thanks. Hope you catch a giant.